Elsie and Francis didn't mean to tell a lie exactly. They just wanted their parents to stop laughing at them. Little did they know that one insignificant lie would someday make them two very famous girls. Growing up in England during World War I could have made for a very lonely childhood. Frances' father was away fighting and her mother was ill from the stress. But Frances had her cousin Elsie and the fairies that populated the nearby brook. Wait a second, fairies? The fairy ring is the true story of these two girls, an imaginative nine-year-old and an aspiring artist whose lives became complicated when they decided to get photographic evidence of Frances' fairies so the adults in their lives would stop teasing them. Elsie's idea was simple. She would draw the fairies and the girls would pose with them. Though the adults who saw their pictures asked what the trick was, Elsie and Francis never told, and soon some pretty important people started to believe that their fairy pictures were real. In some ways, it's hard to relate to a time when adults as smart as Sir Arthur Conan Doyle were falling for photos that from today's perspective are so obviously fake. But the fun of this book is the way two girls outwitted a lot of adults, a true testament to the power of childlike imagination, both then and now.